reality journey. And to achieve that generational wealth, um, we have been listening to, um, I think Dumiso had arranged some of the sessions um, with uh, um, where he was actually taking us through um, how to create a legal structure that one can run with. Um, and with the research that we've been doing so far, um, we so far managed to set up um, a structure that we're still working on anyway, um, where our uh, family assets and um, wealth will be run by two uh, trusts that we've already set up. Um, there's a family trust and a business trust. Um, these two trusts uh, will be the main trusts that are actually um, running with all <clears throat> the assets and as the legal entities um, so that they take us out of uh, that legal obligation um, towards any of the properties or, or assets that we we have. And it, this is uh, the legality sit with those um, trusts and that we just control um, and coordinate and, and benefit from, from the assets. Uh, the whole concept, um, how we are working on it, is firstly with the family trust, the Faisal family trust. Um, we would like to have um, properties or assets that belong to the um, to us um, to be in this trust, um, where there won't be any bonds um, or anyone having interest um, in them. Um, so things such as um, the primary home, the family home where we live in, um, to avoid situations and the risks um, of it being out there. And I mean, we do read on the news about um, properties being um, repossessed and all that. Um, so putting it in the Pfizer family trust um, would actually secure it. Um, this is what we're still working on because at the moment we still have a bond on our, on our home. Uh, but once we complete, then when the registrations come, we'll be registering it into, into this trust. Um, cars, uh, the same applies when um, a vehicle is paid up um, and for one, not to have issues, um, throwing it into the family trust um, and whatever other assets that are key um, to, to our living will, will sit in the trust. Uh, but also um, having an arm where emergency funds, the fundings, the monies, um, the share portfolios, the pro, the the the, the crypto um, <clears throat> portfolios, um, all the assets uh, that one would like um, to safeguard and keep them um, safe on this uh, family um, trust that don't have um, anyone having interest on, and making sure that they are untouchable when they are sitting on uh, on this side. Um, that's the that's the idea to to have all of them on the family trust side, and then the business trust, the uh, virtual business trust. Um, it's where we are running our businesses. Um, currently under this one, uh, we have the company Portlaco Business Solutions, which is the one that we are currently using. Uh, when it comes to um rentals. Um, okay, let's see. Admit your person that's training there. All right. Um, so the business trust, uh, we use this one now to push and build the business. Um, and the, the whole idea is that even when we're acquiring properties uh, that are still with the, with the bank, um, we will be structuring them around um, this side so that you know that's why you grow your your portfolio um and once it has grown enough where you are able to get it paid off um then when registrations come to take out the bank's name on the, the title uh deed then it can move to uh to that other trust the the family trust um <clears throat> also have a company called get it direct uh that 
uh, just as normal shopping and related um, services. This is supposed, or the aim with it um, is so that it can be the cash cow that we'll use to generate income um, as we are now building this uh, portfolio. So this is the legal structure that we have at this stage, but um, it's still open for changes and any advices that we'll be getting from people who can still um, adjust, but to set it in a way that we know it will be safe with all the things that we're running with. Um, when you are expanding your property portfolio, you expose yourself to a lot of uh, legalities of getting uh, um, owing too much um, and risking uh, the banks um, or the courts, I mean, uh, <clears throat> having their hands onto your your assets. This legal structure will be able to to manage that. I hope it um, 